Hello and welcome to another episode of Quick Look. Today we look at Assassin's Creed 2. Um, if you if you have no idea what this is, uh, what this game is or anything, then where the hell have you been? This game almost seems like it's undeserving. Of, My name uh, is Desmond Miles. I'm a of, prisoner uh, of war. Quick look. A war I never knew existed. Who hasn't played through this Waged game? Waged by two groups I never thought were real. Templars and assassins. The animus so, showed me the so truth. If you want to see me play through the things I've seen, things I've been. For the stream. A thousand years Feel of history flowing through the my comments. veins. Rocked if you, you have no idea machine. what this game is, yeah. enjoy. They're using it. Uh, using me those to search for something. This game. You can call still it the enjoy. app. It's an artifact. Like, I don't mind one of many so-called pieces of evil. The time? Templars collect. It's how they stay in power. And if the Templars get their hands on another one, everything will change. They want to make us all their slaves. When they first brought me here, I was afraid of what would happen if I tried to fight Although, back. Although I gotta now, say, I definitely now I'm afraid of what will happen don't if I don't like how they took the series. Like but I can't do it alone. The first one, they made Maybe I don't have to. both factions I more morally Her name gray, is Lucy. Whereas two onwards, the assassins are she's very clearly the good guys and the Templars. She's gone now. Anatomically evil. She's taken away guys. by the bastard Warren Vidic and his Templar masters. I don't know what will happen to and her. Like all the what will happen to me? Philosophical debates between all I know is I need to get one, out of here. Pretty good. And I need to do it soon. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story. I mean, a lot of games in that uh, PS3 era, Xbox 360 era, had a lot of, like, uh, morality games. We have to go. Lucy, where have you been? Why did they... Now. So there's this, this was infamous. Like typical Bioware RPGs. Can't think of what else. Get in. What's with the blood? Are you okay? Look, we have maybe ten minutes, maybe, before they figure out what I've done. If we're I don't know if I like the, the uh, then, wait, we're leaving? Desmond, I animation I'll style they used for this gig compared to later. the first one. But right now I need you to just like shut this, up and They went in a more so uh, cartoony the look where the first right. one had a pseudo realism look. I mean, this still kind of looks somewhat realism, but they clearly stylized it a bit more. So yeah, we're gonna end up seeing a lot of cutscenes and not a lot of gameplay today, I, I think. And I could make the, uh, the quick look be a bit longer than usual, but that does go against just how I do quick looks. This was an interesting choice to give a birthing scene. She's a boy. Oh, my love. Mi dispiace. I, I was at the bank when they told me. Did I miss it? Am I too late? Give him here. Giovanni. Shh, my love. It will be all right. Tu sei un auditore. Sei un combattente. Perciò, combatti. Listen to him. A fine set of lungs. And what shall we call him, my love? Ezio. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. Get up. Let's go. Yeah, well, I'm gonna need a second. There isn't time, Desmond. We have to leave. 
So, he was living as a baby? Because that's what the animus does as you relive your past uh, ancestors' lives. So, that's gotta mess you up in the head, I would think. Really getting out of here, huh? Because getting to... Stergo's got some fucked up it? interior uh, decorators. What? Live as... Uh, Al Sayer gave him eagle vision, so... Hey! You're not supposed to be up here! Did Open becoming a baby... Uh, I'm calling it in! Give him brain damage, weaken his bones, and what, a, what have you. Come on, we need to keep moving. Fancy. Wait, there they are! Don't let them get and away! And I guess that's, that was just something they want you to suspend disbelief and don't think about it too much. Even though they have established lore and such in the first game. Well, I mean, that's just like part of what I was telling you, just like with the morally like, race stuff. It's just like, they took a lot of liberties with the sequel. I mean, it's fine. It's the sequel. It's like, oh, we weren't sure our first idea was going to do so well, so now we're actually going to do exactly what we want for the sequel. What about the cameras? I rigged them to loop old footage. How do you think I managed and then to I've all heard your that um, Assassin's You're Creed good. Brotherhood, which is so the sequel told. to this, was supposed to be the to second fire. half of this Me game. Too. But I guess time constraints and budget issues, they had to have it be a separate game. Careful. We need to get to that elevator on the other side of the room. I mean, I do Follow like the scene they're showing that, the like, they the mass produced the animus. So it wasn't fight. just one rare machine, they have a bunch. What would be cool is if for one game you Hold got on. to play as a Templar the whole game. Yeah, I know. Assassin's Creed 3, you get to play as a Templar for a little bit. Yeah, just for a little bit. And then multiplayer doesn't really count as multiplayer. I mean, that was fun. I don't mind Don't mind uh, my complaining. It's just that it's just multiplayer. There's no story impact. And it, like, that, for real, how could they not, like, tell a story through it? Like, sure. You're playing as a bad guy, but they could add depth to that. It could just be more than just playing a bad guy. Fuck. I thought this card would work. And it Must could be, be a story about system. how someone falls in Wait. with the Templars. They think they're doing something good. Shit. Come on. How did you do that? I don't know. Let's go. I mean, you don't know. You used Eagle what was Vision in the first one to see all those Subject things 16, written in blood. Ezio, Audi, Audi something? I think we've been wrong all along. That's why we need to get out of here. Vidic and the Templars, they're only part of the problem. What do you mean? I'll explain when we get there. Get where? Yeah, the big, uh... <laughs> the big, uh... <laughs> I don't know what you call it, it's not really a... I don't know you call it a plot point, um... But, yeah... So, yeah, the, the series went to a lot of... For the modern audience as the plot... Uh, as the story went along. So that helped with the... With the bad, uh... Oh, bad. I just sort of just fell behind with the series, rather than it, it was it was bad. Although, uh, <laughs> Assassin's Creed's done by Ubisoft, which has become the most notorious for microtransactions. I know everyone thinks EA when someone says microtransactions, but no. Ubisoft's the king of microtransactions. You're joking. It's for your own protection. Oh, man. We're almost there. I've heard it got pretty bad in the most recent Assassin's Creed game, whatever it is, but I, I sort of fell out of the series. I'm pretty sure this is like a, a, a veiled loading screen. This is just Desmond sitting in the trunk. And look, the background's just black, there's no like details for the car interior. Thanks for so that, that. That was clearly Great. a loading screen. The trunk and look at it, like s the well, save way. symbol or the loading symbol, whatever. So, can you tell me what's going on now? There was a reason for the escape, Desmond. Figures. We need your help. For what? Another treasure hunt through time? 
<laughs> Abstergo's gonna replace their Apple of Eden. The map your ancestor found guarantees it. The other assassins, they'll do what they can, where they can, but... What? What is it? We're losing this war, Desmond. The Templars are too powerful. And every day, more of us die. I still don't see how I fit into things. We're going to train you. Turn you into one of us. What? No. No, you've seen me in action. I'm no good at this, and even if I was, it would take months. Years, even. No. Not with the Animus. Not with the bleeding effect. But I'm just one guy. Sometimes, that's all you need. So that's, that's the dumbest I'm line ever. You should just ancestor. whind about, oh, there's too many Ezio? Templars and the assassins are dropping like steps, flies. But oh, one hero can like do you. it. Years of training absorbed in a matter of like days. I thought the assassins are supposed to be smart. Abstergo that's their whole thing. They aren't like oh we have legends, Look, and divine no providence, that, and all that other garbage. Wait. Trust me, okay? All right, I'm in. Tell me what you need. Really? You're sure? I thought you'd be happy about this. Sorry, I'm just a little surprised. I spent the whole ride over here figuring out how I was going to convince you to do this. I mean, that that makes sense. Because, like, they barely know Already? each other. What, they Will know each other for, they... what, a week? Thank you. Lucy! You made it! God, it's been so long. Seven years, can you believe it? Indeed. I'm surprised Welcome they don't back. have any security protocols. Ah, so Someone just walks in unannounced, like, oh, yeah, it must miles, be an assassin. Who are you? I'm sorry, where are my manners? I'm Sean Hastings. This is Rebecca Crane. Nice to meet you, Desmond. Right, well, it's been lovely chatting, but if you don't mind, Desmond, it's best we get straight to work. Time is precious. Doubly so these days. We've got everything set up and, and ready. It's weird for secret face, but they have giant Here, windows like I brought that. You something. A parting gift from Abstergo. Whoa! The memory core! This is amazing! With their data, things are gonna go a lot faster. I'll get to work on merging the code. Like, seriously, big secret base, giant windows. Here, can I get over there? I don't think I ever actually went over there to look at the windows in two. Like in one, I explored all over the little Abstergo uh, 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 room. There are multiple rooms because you can go to that one room with the laptop and such. So this is the hint that oh, you're you're in Italy, which I never actually looked before. Because in the first game, they have that weird lighting where you can't actually see outside the windows. I know, this isn't good for a quick look. This is something you should do in a playthrough. Alright, I'll actually get to the gameplay. Although we got a whole dumb tutorial to go through, so... Real gameplay we might not actually even get to today. Oh, oh! We can't? Or am I... Oh, we have to actually talk to people still. Hey, listen. I just wanted to say thank you. And that I'm sorry. Sorry? Yeah, you know, before. Everything at Abstergo. It was just... I wasn't ready. It's okay. No. Going through all that. Knowing that the Templars still exist. What they're planning. What's done is done, Desmond. You're here now, and that's what matters. Lucy, I've been seeing things. Symbols in my bedroom. The code on the keypad. Just like Altair. It's yeah, we're almost halfway effect. through this quick look. You're I gotta hurry up into the machine memories. and actually get You're some gameplay going. Skills too. In this case, Eagle Vision. Skills? You're more receptive now. So if all goes well, everything Ezio learns in the Animus, you'll learn too. You really think this will work? That I'll become an assassin? You already are an assassin. Oh yeah, this is another problem I have with the series. Yeah, you're supposed to be an assassin, I mean, but at this point you're like a, a super commando fighter who just takes down scores of enemies rather than being stealthy. Like, the first game had it right. I mean, sure, there were times where you fought but by the scores. Do I actually have to talk to everyone before I go inside the machine? Hey Desmond, what's up? 
Just wondering what your role is in all this. No, I'm not one here. Can I skip through this? Okay, no, I cannot. Up and running. Baby? You mean the Animus? Actually, I prefer Animus 2.0, since Baby's twice as awesome as anything you'll find at Abstergo. The Templars might have deeper pockets than us, but they've got no ambition, no passion, no competitive edge. That's why, even with all their resources, anything they can do, I can do better. Faster yeah, except uh, your machine doesn't anyway, actually like translate uh, all the lines. In the beginning part didn't make just... sense. Because we were in the Abstergo Animus and it wasn't translating all the lines. Like, they explain it later in the game, but... Or maybe it's a, maybe it's a sequel they explain it. So yeah, I actually have to talk to all these dummies, which is dumb. So What's we all this stuff could see so little this gameplay stuff, today. Desmond, what a quick look, huh? Special, this really. game has this a rich story. It does, but it's like, from clearly apart, has problems. Really. It requires a great deal of concentration to keep it all moving, so you'll forgive me if I don't have time to play meet and greet. Sean's in charge of maintaining our knowledge archives. It's like a digital library. He'll be riding shotgun Obviously with me the last game had better pacing. So if you come across one. anything of note, people, places, events, etc. Because once you actually get started in the game, you don't actually leave the animus all that much. Yeah, it's, it's like it's just it's gameplay throughout though. the whole game. I also game. provide tactical support for the other assassins. You know, Desmond, the ones who are out there actually doing stuff, risking their lives, little things like that. Maybe now it'll let me in the chair because I don't want to do every little conversation. Yes, yes, let me in finally. We can talk to them later. So, how does this work? Of course. Deep breath. Ah! Oh, what are you, a tiny child? Sean! Well. Here we go. He's got a point. You're supposed to be hardcore assassins fighting to save the world, and you're complaining about a little prick. And this first person vision. I think this is the only time in the series that you do this first person while you're loading into the Animus. It would make more sense if that was the first time you were going to become FCO rather than now the second time. Insieme per la vittoria! Insieme! Insieme! Insieme. Ah, ah, Silenzio, my friends! Silenzio! Grazie! Now, because of the bleeding effect, you, you would think that Desmond would learn Italian that? through playing through as a uh, CEO. He slanders my family's name and forces his own miseries Zero. upon us. If we. Enough of your nonsense, Grullo! <laughs> we were just talking about you. I'm surprised to see you here. I thought the Patsy hired others to do their dirty work. It's your family that cries for guards when there's trouble, Cotardo. Afraid to handle things yourself. Your sister seemed quite satisfied with the handling I gave her earlier. <laughs> <laughs> so another fight sequence just like we just had I mean, I, this is fun and all but it's just funny that we have the exact same thing we just had in a row we haven't actually had any assassinry that's what I'm talking about like oh you're not really an assassin to be fair, yeah, at this point in the story, Ezio's not an assassin either, but still. I'll send you to your grave. I guess it just says, like, how much better the first one was. 
in like basic hey. setup. Behind you. Federico! What are you doing here? I wanted to see if maybe brother had finally learned how to fight. Uh, and <laughs> you have style. But I don't know why I'm not talking over their thing. The subtitles and this is a quick look. If you guys really want to see the story, I'll do a playthrough and I'll uh, not talk during the cutscenes. God, the lock-on system's so bad. You see how it's swinging randomly? Is there a block in this game? I actually don't remember. Oh, damn. I'm, I might actually lose here, which would be pretty pathetic. Well, it's been so long since I've played, like, the, the actual game part of 2, because it's... I'm so used to actually having stuff, because... Assassin's Creed 1, you start with all your stuff, and then they, uh, de-rank you. And then, uh, the next game, you start with all your stuff from the end of this game. And then, you know, stuff happens. I won't get into spoilers for that, even though probably everyone has played through 2 and Brotherhood. And I should be at you guys, hey, don't spoil, like, everything past 3. And that's kind of where I dropped off. I don't have medicine. I actually don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, we got two health left. I'm not used to this game. I've been playing like... Uh, uh, what's it? <laughs> game of it. God of War. Okay, so if you screw up and they beat you up, it autos. Okay, so there is a mercy. <laughs> Just a scratch. Let the doctor decide. I think this is the first time I've actually lost Besides, that no bad that the game cutscene had to save me. <laughs> wasted it on women and wine, huh? You'd hardly call it wasted. Lend me some floorings then. Or have you done the same? <laughs> <laughs> Search them. <laughs> There's bound to be something in their pockets. Yeah. So, yeah, what a hero Ezio is. The rich playboy screwing around all day, fighting, drinking, and spending time with women. This is a nice new addition I'd like to add. They added into the game actual looting and having money. Va bene. That should be enough. Let's get it should be enough, but I'm gonna go on. get more. <gasps> Don't cut scene away from me, I want the treasure. Yeah, boy, we're almost uh, out of time for the... the quick look. Yeah, I, I knew all those dumb conversations would take forever, and... as far as I could tell, the cutscenes are not skippable. Hurry, Ezio! The sooner we're done Let's with the see. doctor, nope. the sooner Nope, cannot we... skip. Let's sleep. Oh my god, great pathing. No need to be shy. Come forward. Ben trovato, doctor. Hmm. Fratelli auditori, why am I not surprised? You've made quite a mess of yourself, young man. It's nothing, really. You must help him. It's that weird that they all acid. wear Plague Doctor masks when there's no plague going on around. And if... The, uh, I actually don't know when the bubonic plague was uh, commonplace. Wasn't that this early? Because what, what, is, what is this game take place? Uh, Quite a night. 
Indeed. It's like what the late 1400s to the the oh, 1500s. Wait. They are something like that. <laughs> We should head home, Ezio. Yeah, because we're in the Renaissance. I'm pretty sure yes. the bubonic plague's long and gone. Feel f anyone who knows history better than me, that? feel free to correct me in the comments. Where? Uh, roof of that church. Do I actually have to be on all number? Uno, due, tre. <coughs> Baby brother still has much to learn. <coughs> Yeah, even though I'm in front of you, you idiot. Come on, Tantaruga. Like seriously, what the hell are you talking about, dummy? I'm beating you. Like Come for on, real, man. like this that way. was pathetic. Where are you going? You'll see. It's kind of dumb that they're just like, oh, we'll just climb this building. At least with um, Altair, he was like trained to do it. It is a good life we lead, brother. <sighs> the best. I mean, again, never rich change. playboys who do whatever they want all day. Change us. Let's go. Wait. What? Ezio, let Christina sleep. There will be time enough for that later. Ah. Yeah, let's go bang this chick I kind of stalk. And, like, why is he scanning the city? Like, he would know his own city really well. The whole reason Altair did that is so he could see where he could, uh, move into certain areas for an assassination. So it's Vieri. I'd better hide. Like, I'm all for Keep the game looking. playing the same Look as the previous the one, but, like, there's no in-lore reason for why he's doing what he's doing. Did one of his men just push him? Did you guys see that? Was that a glitch or does that always happen? I don't remember it happening before. Have I seen that Christina! Christina! Who's there? Me! Oh! Ezio! I should have known! Yeah, Ezio, in? my stalker. Fine, but only for a minute. A minute is all I need. Indeed. Well, wait. Uh, it came out wrong. Come here. Oh. oh, it's you. Oh, it's you. Oh, it's you. You took my clothes off. So terrible that figlio d'un cane. What is this? Perdonate, messere. Chiedo venia. I'll kill you. Oh, no, no, that's not necessary. Guards, guards. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty big deal. Now, <laughs> that's really not a good Like it's probably hard to marry her off. And you know they took that kind of no. thing seriously in the past. You have me confused with someone else. She needed some help. Yes. Some things. Move, idiots. God, I swear the buttons don't work. Go away. Oh, 
I mean, geez, it's already time to to wrap things up, and I'm not even out of the tutorial. A whole lot of time. Maybe I could stretch it a bit longer. Yeah, so far I've had these last a bit longer, so I guess I can go uh, do a little more gameplay. Like, I don't even have the, the assassin's armor. Uh, you know what? Let's just go do the next main mission and see where that leaves us. Maybe we go a little lower, maybe we go a little under. Normally, I would just go do the viewpoints and do all the side objectives, but for now, I'm just gonna move along. Good morning, Father. Come with me. Is something wrong? Do you think me blind and deaf, son? I know all about your fight with Vieri di Pazzi last night, and then this little visit to Christina. Your behavior is unacceptable. It... It... It reminds me of myself when I was your age. Yeah, what a great father, yeah. You're screwing around all the time. Work today. Even though no, you're supposed Padre. to be a presentable <laughs> member of, of society, because you're a rich noble family. But nah, boys will be boys. We faced, father. Return to me like, when especially it's done. given this time, I couldn't imagine a father approving. Unless he's a bad guy. I mean, <laughs> never mind. I guess it doesn't really matter with spoilers, because everyone probably knows at this point, but, um. That's gonna say, that's why the Templars had him killed! Because he was a blight on society, raising his degenerate son. Is it on the roof? Yeah, it's like one of the thieves or something. Oh, no, it's not. They're down there. Ah, Ezio. Oh, no, it's not. That's later. This is somewhere in the nobody. I have a letter for Messer Lorenzo. I'll see that he receives it when he returns. Returns? They've gone to Villa Careggi, I'm afraid. And not expected back for at least another day. I'll let my father know. Seems odd that they have that. It's like, oh, guy's not here. Up the good work, Biscero. <laughs> you worry too much, Giovanni. He called him penis. Is that even really an insult? Ah. Hello, son. It's disrespectful, I suppose. Good morning, Gonfaloniere Alberti. To you as well, young man. I trust you delivered the message. Si, padre. But it seems Lorenzo is out of town. Hmm. I did not anticipate this. What does it matter? So you wait another day or two. Listen, your mother and sister have been looking for you. I'll need you again in a little while, but for now, see if you can't help them. Are you sure? Yes, yeah, now help them with you busy work. Us. Good to see you, Ezio. So yeah, I'm actually going to end it here, because this is a quick look, don't want it to go longer, like I've 
Uh, the previous quick looks have almost been identical in time. Good for me managing that. But uh, yeah. So I gotta uh, stretch this out for like three more minutes, I'd say, just to have just about the same amount of time. Okay, uh, so let's see. Uh, thank you all for watching my video. Please like, comment, share, subscribe, all the good stuff at all the usual locations. If you want to see more Assassin's Creed, not just two, let me know in the comments. You guys could be responsible for me getting back into the series. Have you been Especially since I've been looking for what what am I gonna play through next? I, I mean, this quick look uh, segment is is fun and all, but uh, eventually it's gotta come to an end. It's only got so many games I could play for the quick look section. I mean, I got quite a few, so this segment could last quite a while. Especially if I'm skip days like yesterday. About skipping yesterday, I plan on making another video right after this. Because I, uh, I should get back to a video every day. Unless something happens and I'm busy or something. And I, lately it's just been, oh, I don't feel like it and I'm lazy. So yeah, uh... That's Assassin's Creed 2. We're gonna have another video coming up coming up real soon. So I'm gonna just hop right back into streaming and not. So this video will be uh, accompanied by another video shortly thereafter for those that uh, watch it on YouTube. And, and... oh, did I not say it, say that? Yeah, so I said please like, comment, share, share, subscribe, and all that stuff, but I didn't say. Uh, that location. So yeah, you can find my videos on YouTube, Twitch, Rumble, and Odyssey. And if you want more than just videos, you can follow me at Locals and Getter. Yeah, stretching it out for like 30 more seconds just to make sure the video is the proper length as the other ones. I know, I'm just, I'm just wasting time here. Whee! What do you know the purpose of these dumb things? Other than hiding, like, was there... Did these actually exist in time? I mean, I'm glad they added, like, the hay barrels as something to hide in, because that's... Those would be around. Okay, no, we're for real stopping here. Alright. Bye, everyone.